But right now we're gonna go try to go catch some pike and bass and stuff in a river. Oh! Oh my god! We're going on another trip today, guys. Uh, my room is an absolute mess right now as I'm packing for this trip. I don't even know what's going on. I'm so, like, I'm just overwhelmed right now, we'll say. But we're going to have a lot of fun, so it's worth it. Uh, I catch, I catch you guys tomorrow morning because I'm going to put it this way. I'm exhausted. I need to get some sleep, rest up for this trip, and it's going to be an absolute blast. See you, Larry. See you, fishies. can't believe it someone's actually traveling with me this time and we're at the airport right now location is a secret right now but you'll find out in like approximately 30 seconds so it feels weird I'm used to like sitting at home yeah he's used to living through the screen to see me travel but this time he's coming with well, per usual delayed flight they don't even have an estimate so I don't even know when we're gonna leave if we're ever gonna even go there well we waited here for like two and a half hours because we got here like an hour early and it's been over like an hour and a half by the time like they delayed it so who knows man it's very annoying very annoying i will say we're going to chick-fil-a guys dude they're only serving breakfast that's such a disappointment dude nothing's going our way right now i mean it makes sense it's 9 30 but still I, i'm not a breakfast guy man and uh, dude, i'm not getting no egg and biscuit thing from chick-fil-a but i want that sandwich they're starting to serve lunch now we got some Chick-fil-A. Apparently the flight's supposed to board in like a couple of minutes or something, or 15 minutes or so. Hopefully that's true. All right guys, five hours later and like 50 bucks in food and coffee down, and we are slowly gonna get boarded here. Hopefully, maybe, probably not, but I'm, I, I got, I, I'm losing my mind. Finally on the plane, guys. Eight hours later, guys, and we freaking made it. More than 12 hours later. No, about 12 hours, Let's like 13 go. hours later, we're here. We're here in New Jersey, guys. The worst fishing state, freshwater-wise. Saltwater, we're gonna kill them tomorrow. But right now, we're gonna go try to go catch some pike and bass and stuff in a river. Got the Celsius, we're gonna be fueled up this weekend. We're gonna need it, because we're gonna catch a fish that uh, has been on my bucket list for a long time. <laughs> And I know Joey wants to catch one too. Very teethy, toothy, I meant. So something very familiar to me, guys. We're going for pike right now. I got the spinner bait. We're gonna absolutely crush him. Absolute homie right here. It's my boy Whisper. Dude, he's so freaking cute. See, I don't know why I came to New Jersey, honestly. Like, there's so many other states and I picked New Jersey. <laughs> We're going for a fish in every single state. That's a goal, like a bucket list thing of mine. I mean, not only for YouTube, that I mean, it'd be cool to document all that, but just like for life in general. Just like, that's definitely a goal of mine. And if I catch a fish in Jersey, that'll, I think seven states now, so we're getting closer. All right, guys, made it to the river here. We're going for freaking pike today, dude. It's my element. We're gonna slay them. Got a spinnerbait tied on. Let's freaking crush these guys. Just slow rolling the spinnerbait right along here. It should get the job done. I mean, I can pretty much cast right across this entire river. Pretty much perfect. Just reel it straight through. There's bound to be something here. That's how you get to the freaking good fishing spots. You gotta walk through all this crap. Literally. That's how you do it, guys. Guys, we're switching to a whopper plopper. You do some top water action. I've never caught a pike on top water, so that would be absolutely crazy if I did. And who doesn't like a good top water bite, dude? Let's be real. Whopper plopper, guys. I've actually never used one of these before, but if I get a pike on top water, that would be absolutely insane. Oh, that's the cast right there. Oh, dude. Dude, that, dude, throw yours in, throw, throw yours in right behind it. When they missed top water, you know that strat right there? Dude, that was insane. Dude, that was I literally called it too, I was like, that's the cast. That looked freaking amazing. He freaking missed it, I didn't even get the hooks in him. Oh, there it is, got him, yes sir, no! <laughs> dude, dude, Ooh. dude, that was insane. Dude, I freaking dude, I already had how'd I freaking choke all this? That's typical me though, I'm not gonna lie. Dude, the freaking top water is a strat. Dude, we can't lose this bait. Dude, I'm gonna about to, I literally don't think I can get out. <laughs> I'm low-key stuck, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, wait a second. Oh my gosh, bro. There we go. <laughs> bro, I'm knee deep in the water somewhere, brother. <laughs> You said not to get your car muddy? 
Yes, I broke the stick. Yes. Come here, buddy. Oh my gosh, we did it. We got the bait back, guys, and I'm just covered in mud, but it's completely worth it. Dude, I need to freaking land one now. I shanked two fish. I'm full of mud. It's just, it has to happen right now. Oh my gosh, right next to the freaking bank, dude. I freaking shanked it again. I don't know if that was a pike though. Dude, I'm so bad, I'm so bad at fishing. I just, I'm gonna quit. Dude, 0 for 3 right now, man. Yeah, we don't want footage. We don't want. <laughs> yeah, we, we don't want footage of that, man. <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh no, dude. Rich nice. being not money. That's great, dude. Oh. On the just, bag track? Look at this, dude. That's insane. I'm just. My crocs are completely ruined. They're slippery. It's just. Dude. It's a good spot, though. It's New Jersey, baby. Joey's only missed three of them. Only three of only them. Only three. I've Don't worry zero. about it. Well, at least I had bites. Oh! Guys, I can't believe I freaking blew three blow ups already. That's insane. I'm just that bad. Oh, wait. There's a fish. Yes. <laughs> Not a pike. It's a freaking little, uh, it's a little largey. He is covered in mud right now, dude. He's not the fish I wanted to catch tonight, but I will definitely take him. I got, I got the skunk out of the boat and we checked off another state for catching a fish in. That is what you like to see. Dude, I feel so bad. You literally just flew that thing in. I frick, because I thought it was a pike and I was about to set that hook to Narnia. Anyways, it's a tiny little dink bass. I mean, I will definitely take him. My first fish of the night. It is not a pike, although I had at least two pike blow ups. I don't know what that third one was. It probably was a bass. It wasn't as extreme of a blow up. I will definitely take my fish. First fish in Jersey for the trip. All right, see you later, buddy. Yeah, dude, with that freaking flight delay, I didn't even know if we were gonna come in tonight. So being out in the water catching the fish is definitely a big plus for the day. Boosts my spirits a lot. Yeah, I really need to like learn how to like calm down on my hook sets, but I just can't. It's freaking bass fisherman for you. Right in the middle of the woods. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, freaking ate it there. Did you get that on video? Oh, it's on the GoPro. Oh, yeah, dude. Oh, I ate it, dude. Oh, yes. Oh. He didn't even have it, dude. That was a bass for sure. Oh, oh, that's beautiful. All right, well. I don't know. Is it, do you have rock bass in here or something? That's what it's reminding me of. Dude, it's something freaking tiny though. What's that, like one for eight now? I think I freaking bent my reel out. Get him, get him. Dude, check out this tank, guys. Look at that, freaking arowana, peacocks, tarp. Three peacocks, two arowana. This is a stormy cat, This is a Senegal bison. Yeah, that guy back there. Yeah, dude, this is definitely a lot cooler than my tank, I will say. <laughs> I love you, Larry, but Beta's not that cool. Oh yeah, this is actually my butt, guys, by the way. I switched it out so I didn't freaking ruin his car, but yeah, that's when I ate it. Anyways, it was a freaking great day out there on the water. I got a lot of blow -ups. Two of them were pike for a fact. That third one, I don't know what it was. Danny caught a pike, landed it, grabbed it. I was running over there to record it, and he just chucks it in the river because he said, I don't want content. I don't want a picture with this thing. I don't want any trace that I caught it. And then he slipped and fell, which made it even better. It was just a great trail of events. I mean, it was quite the interesting adventure out there today, I will say. I mean, a lot of falling, a lot of slipping, getting stuck in mud, quicksand, blowing off freaking top water baits. It's just a typical me day, you know, just freaking blowing everything, ruining it all, but it's fine. It's completely fine. All right, guys, so we're preparing for tomorrow. We're gonna, not going to spoil it, what it is. Mm -hmm. We're going to get like three videos tomorrow. It's going to be insane. Hopefully. We're going fishing for bluegill. bluegill That's what it is. Only bluegill. bluegill. Yeah. Freaking biggest bluegill ever. It's I probably world record bluegill. That's nice. the goal. Well, this is where we're going to end the night, guys. Hope you enjoyed today's video. And if you did, be sure to leave that thumbs up. And I got to catch a freaking pike on top water. I don't think I've ever done it. And I just missed like three of them today. It was really frustrating. But at least Danny caught one, even though he didn't even see it. What fish you want to catch? Um, What's it called? A shark. I think it's a bluefin carpet carp. Oh, that's what it is. Dude, I always get those mixed up. Mm -hmm. As always, folks, fish with <whistles> topwater whopper ploppers. Passion. Uh oh. Can somebody come and save me? I just wanna know. I wanna know.